So when I get on, I'll make a announcement, you know. Hi, good morning, you know, please have your fare out. We are inspecting, you know. I give them a second or two um, to start getting their stuff ready. Um, and then I'll go on and by the time I get to maybe the sixth person, you know, everybody's like having it ready. I don't just walk on and say, hey, let me see. I'll make an announcement and get them prepared. I'll hear people say, oh, I'm on this bus line and no one pays. And, um, oh, go check that neighborhood or go check that neighborhood. But it's the perception. So I'm actually out here educating these individuals. Like just because you don't see someone physically paying does not mean that they're not paying because Muni has various uh, forms of fair media. Most of the time when we after we issue citation, we, uh, we will offer them uh, like program for the, the lifeline pass if they qualify based on income or if they're seniors, some of them don't really know, they, they might qualify for the free senior pass or discount pass. A lot of patrons, they, they don't pay the fare for whatever reason. So we either need to uh, issue a citation or find out the reason they, they could not pay. It varies because there's a reason. Uh, either A, uh, they simply don't have it. Um, at that time, I will give them uh, what we have a red and white piece of paper and we'll say, hey, you know what? Muni has different fair, you know, discounted fares, and I'll let them know, hey, this is what you need to do. If you cannot afford to ride Muni, check out these programs. They may benefit you. Fair compliance to me is important because it shows we run an honor system, so everybody has to pay their fair share. If I'm paying, I believe everybody else should pay.